all right guys welcome to the channel Whew. it's getting a little muggy out what i'm working on i'm trying to get this entire bottom uh the second coat on i still got to get on my knees that's why i got my knee pads on get under there fix that or get that painted then i'm going to get the ladder and get up and finish that uh that vent cover uh that vent's going to be painted black that ought to look good while i'm up there i'm gonna see if i can peek up in there see what's up in there that's just a little you know crawl space and i wouldn't say crawl space you know a little vent where the house comes to a t because in here you see there's a ceiling so there's a few feet up there i wonder if there's any goodies in there i don't know i'd see where that rat's living so we're gonna get that done and here's what i was talking about i need to cut a strip where that got tore off uh that should be i, sh I have that over there in the pile it's not going to be cedar i may have a piece of that i'll have to look and then we'll get to painting the black but it's starting to cloud up it don't look like rain to me but just hazy but it's kind of cool up here we can look down at the garden that's going to look cool when it's when the tomatoes are tall and everything's growing real good and over there we got a melly they find the darndest spots they like laying right there uh, nice and shady in there and that that's like a real mossy grass type stuff in there they like laying on that all right i'll check in with you periodically here we go well we got two coats of the tan on there the only spot i didn't get and probably don't need to explain why i have not got that yet yeah i'm gonna have to get me a pillow lay down there and paint that but we'll save that for last i'm gonna grab me some black here in a minute and uh start trimming out the black and that's when it's gonna start to take shape and i'm gonna go ahead i ain't doing nothing in there i'm gonna cover this up so i didn't paint past that point had a little accident a couple of them oh well i'll just stand over there a bunch of times and it'll wear off and i had to take that light off and it was full of all that junk i'm gonna put i've got a couple new lights i'm gonna put on once i get it done and uh i got a little work to do in here frame that out somehow uh i don't know we'll see what i come up with but for most part this stuff's on and you know you just gotta gob up the brush and get inside here fill in all the little cracks and man it looks really nice now and then of course that's gonna be black i didn't mind about getting paint on that uh ain't gonna hurt it because it's gonna be black i'll have to be extra careful when i do that all right let me get busy party day and tilly has moved or millie has moved I don't know where Tilly is. She's somewhere around here.
I'm out of here. Ah. Not as steady as I once was. <laughs> <coughs> I got a smaller paintbrush. When some things get worn out, it's hard to do some cutting in. Well, get some daggum paint on there, Mike. I don't want to come back and do any touch-up if I don't have to. I do not enjoy being up here. But it's probably, it's metal, so it's going to take two coats. Ooh, I feel some heat coming out of there, man, so that's doing its job. Yeah, it is. Starting to come together. Ah, the last guy that painted this was too lazy to get in there. Not me. I'm going to get it. Don't call me lazy. Yeah, this is the brush I, sh I should have had anyway. <coughs> I've had a bad cough for about two weeks. Man, sinuses or something. So, excuse me. Uh, should have pulled the ladder back. That's where your coloring book day skills come, come in handy. Don't go outside the lines like I did there. Now nah, that... I didn't hit that, it dripped on there. I had too much paint on the brush. All right, let me move this ladder forward. Get on up, y'all. This is not your average house. So, got all kinds of angles. What not. Who needs masking tape? Ah, masking tape. Don't use it. Oh, look at there. Missed the spot. This is the weirdest door trim I've ever seen. I've never seen anything like that. What I'm going to do is come back later and cut in those. That will take a steady hand. Well, I gotta get up top. And then we'll call this one good, guys. I won't make you, I won't make you suffer through it all. Alright, guys, I'm gonna go make myself some lunch and come back and finish painting this black. Probably do another coat on that. In fact, I know I'll have to. Then come back and actually I can touch some of that up here pretty quick. Uh, once that dries. So Ain't a whole lot left on the black, just a little piece there. Finish that, that, the face, and under here. But it sucks that black up bad, because that's rough cut cedar planks or something in there. You can't buy that today, I'll tell you that. All right, I'll be back. You know, you would have told me 20 years ago, that one day thousands of people would watch annoying advertisements to watch me paint a lot of left you off the planet who wants to watch me paint this way and this way this way and this way. That's 
say he does, man. I gotta repair that. We're so close. But that's the limit of that ladder. I can't get way up there. And it's raining. Uh, I'm gonna finish it. It's just barely raining. It doesn't even look like rain clouds, man. I don't know where it's coming from. So I'm gonna go get the bigger ladder. Finish that up. That's pretty rough wood right there, but it'll be fine once it's painted. Uh, and I've got all that cut in underneath there. Underneath that one. So all I've really got to do is there and there. And the face tops of here. And then, uh, yeah. I'll wait till it starts raining and crawl under there. Finish that tan. <laughs> Let's talk, take a walk around back and see what it looks like. I haven't been back down here yet to look at it. Oh, no, no, no peeking. You get to see it when I get to see it. Are you ready? Here we go. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, that looks a lot better. Except for that little part in the corner. I didn't get I'm using the rain as an excuse to not get to that today but there's gonna be more painting to do and I think what I'm gonna do guys this sounds like a good idea to me I don't like how the bottom of this looks under the screens just that tan right underneath I'm just gonna put a one by four piece of trim that'll balance that out to where that looks better uh, and also up there I don't know I may put some real small trim on that that would look good with a little black on it as well or i can just paint a black strip all the way around it but that's going to change it ain't going to keep looking like that well, that looks a lot better than that ugly green now there's two coats of the tan which is called italian silk and then there's thick thick coat of the midnight stroll now both of those are a satin exterior paint uh, that's exactly what I used on the front and I'm gonna have to go around front and repaint the front because that storm with the hail Got pop marks all in it. So well, That's a big difference there and if it wasn't starting to rain, I'd probably finish these poles and the rest of it uh, But man, I'm tired. I've been at it since 8 this morning. It's about 2 somewhere in there So we're gonna call it a video and uh I think I'm going to stick with this until it's done. The railings, everything. And I'm thinking about staining the deck as well. Because I made a mess of it today. So, we'll just stick with one thing at a time. Do the patio. Get the rest of the trim on the dog apartment. I am going to build them a better doggy door. I'm even considering a window in there. Because it would be a whole lot better with a window. I don't know. We'll see. Maybe at one out front or something. Uh, but there's some trim yet that needs to go on there. I got to finish the eave there. We may even put a gutter on there as well. But the budget is tight, so I got to do these things a little bit at a time. So, you know, that paint, yeah, that was, uh, what, 100 bucks for two gallons of paint and uh, some cheap paint brushes. So, yeah, it ain't like I can just rush to the store and get anything I want. So I have to do it when I got the money to do it but that helps that helps man that looks so much better and that top piece of trim is pretty bad up there but now that it's painted black you can't see it you know it looks pretty good to me it's good enough for the back side of a house all right guys thanks for watching happy trails let's take a peek at the little buggers 
Oh, one little patch of grass. That's where you guys are all congregating, huh? Yeah, dirty nose. Willie. Oh, here comes Lucy. Lucy is the most calm and easygoing puppy of the bunch. I think she's the next smallest, next to Toast. But I'm going to take one of these guys to the vet this week. See what's going on with their skin. May not be nothing. Uh, but you don't need to take them all in. I'll take Willie in. He's the worst. And uh, I've seen this before. You know, they just, they roll in everything nasty. And I'll see if they're old enough to get some kind of a flea treatment. Get your guys a big drink. Get your big drink. See, dirty nose ain't bad at all. Neither is Oreo. Well, you're a little pink around the legs. Yeah, and you guys are scratching. I know stuff's driving you nuts. But you weren't old enough to get flea medicine. But maybe you are now. I'll have to look into something. Or at least we'll give you a, a bath and some Dawn. That'll help. Uh, yeah, I don't look forward to bathing you little smellies. But you need it. Who butts? It's barely raining. It feels good to me. Look at you guys all holed up in your dog houses. Yeah. What do you think, Melly? You got flies? Get that fly, it's on your paw. Get it? <laughs> Silly.